Time action on Dylan. He's got ace high, ace five. Min raise makes it 500,000 to go. Man, if guy wins a pot with six threes, why not play the six fours? Right, splash around, and good luck. Here we are. It's a four, nine four, do so. James out flopping Dylan again. He checks. Well, Dylan gonna make the continuation bet. He does have the wheel draw, the gut shot straight draw. It's a half a million dollar bet. It looks like another check raise by James Carroll, and that's exactly what it is. And Dylan's gonna be saying to himself, you gotta be kidding me, this guy can't hit every single flop. Every time I bet the flop, he raises me. Dylan is making this call, hoping to hit the three, but no, it's a deuce, pairs the board. Now well, action's on James. And he checks. All in. Wow, he is pushing all in. He's gonna try to bluff for all his money. And it actually could work. It's a hefty bet. And the tournament on the line. Usually players don't bluff off all their money, this kind of bet, when they don't have something pretty strong error out in front. This could be a really bad call. <laughs> well, James even laughing about it. Could be a really bad call here. It could be a great one that gets him the title, Vince. That would be incredible. Good call. What a call by James Carroll. These guys fight for every pot. He's got the best hand if he can dodge an ace three or a five. He'll be the champion. Dylan even sort of salutes him for making that call. Unfortunate river for you, though. Top 10 calls of the season, no doubt about it. He is one card away from becoming a WPT champion at Bay 101. Oh. He's hit a river card already once tonight. Can he do it again? No. Does it happen? James Carroll is our champion.